Good morning everyone. Welcome to English class with teacher Munira. Hi students. How are you doing today? I hope you are having a fantastic day. Okay, our lesson for today is unit 9, A Heart of Gold. If you have your textbook with you, turn to page 92. Okay, now we are going to continue our literature. Okay, previously, Cerita Hansel and Gretel ni kita berhenti dekat mana? Dekat dia kena tinggal dalam hutan dengan mak tiri dia, kan? Okay, now let's read. Scared and all alone, Hansel and Gretel walked deeper into the forest. They were cold, hungry and tired. Suddenly, they saw a beautiful but curious looking cottage. They ran to the cottage. To their surprise, it was made of chocolates, candies, cakes and sweets. Hungrily, they gobbled down chocolate bricks from the walls and the candy knocked from the door. All of a sudden, the door creaked open and an old lady appeared. Who is eating my house? asked the lady. We are sorry, said Hansel and Greta. Cackling, the old lady replied. Don't worry, help yourself to whatever you want. Then, come inside for a nap, she said. Hansel and Gretel ate as much as they could and then went into the house. They were very tired and soon fell asleep. The next day, the old lady put Hansel in a cage and forced Gretel to do the house chores. Hansel and Gretel soon realized she was actually a witch. Every day, the witch fed Hansel lots of food. She wanted to make him fat as she planned to eat him. Every morning, she said, Hansel, stick out your finger. I want to see how fat you are today. Hansel knew she had poor eyesight, so he would stick out a chicken bone instead. Why are you getting... Why aren't you getting fat, Hansel? Oh, I have to feed you more, said the witch. Finally, the day came when the witch would wait no longer. Okay, so this part of the story ialah apabila Hansel and Greta jumpa dengan witch. Okay, what happened? Okay, uh, uh, on the first paragraph, they jumpa rumah wish tu. It is made of chocolates oh. and then candy cake and sweets. Okay, since dua, dua orang ni dah memang dah lapar, dah kebulu dah. Sebab kena tinggal dalam hutan. So, apa lagi dah nampak makanan depan mata, dia pun makan lah. Okay, and then tiba-tiba pintu pun terbuka. Pintu terbuka tu, keluarlah nenek tua ni. Dia tanya, siapa yang makan? Uh, lepas tu Hansel and Greta ni pun minta maaf Okay and then dia pun Lepas tu nenek tua tu pun ajak dia masuk rumah Lepas sudah makan Okay yang perenggan ketiga ni The third part here is that Hansel, Hansel kena kurun dalam cage Tapi Greta dia kena paksa buat kerja rumah Okay kenapa dia kena kurun dalam cage? Sebab nenek tu sebenarnya nenek kebayan Nenek wish wish Okay so nenek kebayan ni dia nak makan Hansel Dia nak makan budak-budak So sebab tu lah dia bagi makan Hansel banyak-banyak Supaya Hansel jadi gemuk Bila dah gemuk banyak isi sedap dah nak makan lah Mula sikit kenyang Okay Now let's take a look at the vocabulary Gobble Gobble tu apa maksud dia? Okay kita boleh tengok dekat perenggan pertama Okay, gobble hungrily, they gobble down. Gobble down tu apa? Melahap. Okay, makan dengan lapor. Lapor tu sangat dah. Melahap ya. Pelahap. Okay. And then the second paragraph kita ada creak. Okay, creak tu apa? Bunyi pintu terbuka. The door cricket open. Bunyi pintu terbuka. Bunyi creak. Ah, itulah bunyi creak. Okay, and then second paragraph also kita ada cackling. Cackling ni apa dia? Gelak jahat Kalau kita tengok cerita Cerita-cerita Cerita katung Cerita superhero Apa semua tu Mesti ada orang jahat tu Dia gelak jahat Gitulah ho, 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 ho. Macam jahat-jahat sangat-sangat ha, Gitulah Macam gambar sebelah ni ha, Gitulah Okay now Let's take a look at the homework I want you to think Number one If you Hansel Would you eat the delicious cottage Or starve yourself Until you are home Okay Kalau awak Hansel Awak nak makan ke Awak nak berlapar Okay, number two. If you are Gretel, would you accept the 
The witch invitation to nap in the cottage. Ah, kalau awak ni kereta, awak nak terima tak? Apa ni? Jemputan nenek kebayang tu nak tid suruh tidur dalam rumah dia. Ah, okay. Think. Okay. Okay. So, I think this is it from me. Thank you for your participation. Bye-bye.